Hey guys, it's Ashley from Bacolic Songs, and this is my <coughs> October TBR, which is a couple days late. And you guys, <laughs> there's so many on here, I just, I can't figure out what I want to read this month. And a lot of them are thrillers. <laughs> like, probably more than half of them are thrillers. <coughs> There are also ones that I can get on audiobook too as well, so that was another thing. And then some of them are ones that I'm using for my A to Z challenge. And then some are left over from last month. So yeah, that's that's what we're doing. So we're just gonna get right, right into it. <clears throat> um I've already read Remember. I've already listened to one. I've already listened to one book. And I've read another. I believe I can't even remember. Just a second. <clears throat> okay. So the two books that I have on my list that I've already read was City of... Why, Ashley? I just it's one of those things. <laughs> maybe, maybe I don't know. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so the first one I've already taken care of is "City of Ghosts" by Big, um, Victoria Schwab, which I listened to on audio, and I'm trying to listen to "Tunnel of Tunnel of Bones" by her. But for some reason, I can't figure out why Scrub does, does this to me. I don't know if you guys will know if you watch this video and happen to use it. But it always, I get pretty far and then it just stops and tells me there's an error. And it won't let me finish it. And it's turned into like two or three books. And it's really frustrating because I'm halfway through Tunnel of Bones and I can't finish it because I don't have the, a physical copy. I just have the audiobook and I'm just, it's frustrating. And it did that to me on a couple of others too. Anyways, enough of my ranting. <clears throat> uh -huh. So the next, the second one that I finished was Kingdom of Souls. And yeah, that one's over there. I don't like going up and get it. So on to the books that I want to read. Okay. I have started You Are Here by Jennifer E. Smith. It's a tiny little book. It's the Y in the A to Z challenge. So that's where this one's going. <clears throat> like I said, bear with me, there's a lot. And I know I won't get to all these, I know I won't, but I just, I keep switching back and forth, I don't know what I want to read, so. <laughs> I know. And a lot of these are book of the month books that I've got, so. <clears throat> so the first one is this month's book of, the book of the month, if you haven't watched that video is Leave the World Behind by Ramon Alm. It's a tiny book, but it sounds so interesting and so good. I might start this one. I have no idea. A lot of them are tiny though, so that's good. <clears throat> Another one that I want to read, and it's also October, so I'm trying to pick a lot of thrillers. Spooky type books. It's Mexican Gothic by Silvia Moreno Garcia. <clears throat> We're just going with all the thrillers, I guess, kind of. Thriller horror books. The next one I have is The Family Upstairs by Lisa Jewell. I want to say this is on an audiobook that I can listen to once those decide to start actually working for me. So there's that one. And then I have, this is a chunker guy. Imaginary Friend by Stephen Chbosky, but I have this on, um, I borrowed this from the liar, from the liar, from the library on audiobooks, so I'm gonna start, have to listen to it. I started it, only got like two chapters in. But yeah, hopefully I can get this one done since it's audio. <clears throat> the next one 
next one that I chose was the Sundown Motel by Simone St. James. Again, I've heard it's really good, so we'll see. The next one that I've kind of started reading already is called Under My Skin by Lisa Unger. I've only read about that much. It's interesting. We'll see. And um, this is also one for my A to Z challenge for you. <clears throat> and then the, another one I have is The Shadows by Alex Horn. This is another book that's on scribd for me. It shows that I can listen to it come the 20th. So we'll see if that actually works or not. If not, I have a copy. <laughs> The next one is Furthermore by Tahara Mafi. This is my A to Z challenge for the F. And I did this kind of series backwards. I read which, which would I think is the second, like the companion of this. And I read that one already. So I do want to read this. I love the color. Bright. There's that one. And then the last three are ones from my past TBR. <clears throat> that I don't, I don't. So this one is the Borden, Mur the Borden Murders. Um, Lizzie Borden and the Trial of the Century. I'm still kind of reading. I mean, this is more of a just whenever I feel like uh, reading about her. This is what I think. So it's not necessarily, you know, a have to for me. <clears throat> the other book, which I've gotten pretty, well, I almost got like halfway through, is The Vanishing House by Brett Bennett. I'm always going to keep putting this on my TBR, but there's also the audiobook, but it's like a couple months out before it'll let me listen to it, so... We'll see. But like I said, it's pretty far ahead. And of course we have Empire of Storms by Sarah J. Mass, <clears throat> which I am reading, but I'm reading it on my phone. So whenever I don't have a book and I'm out, I, I read it on my phone. And then I think I'm like, I couldn't even tell you, maybe a hundred pages in. Not even that. I don't even know. See, a hundred pages. Stupid. So yeah, on script it tells me this title failed to load. It says try again later. For contact support. I've just done that, and it's really. Starting to piss me off, but I don't. Anyways, enough about that. <clears throat> Empire of Storms. There's that, which I'm reading. Doesn't say. I wonder if it'll load and tell me where I am at. Okay, so I'm on page seventy-eight of almost eight hundred pages. So, like I said, I'm just reading it on my phone. When I get a chance. So. Yeah. That's that. Oh. Okay. So. So I've read about that much. So. I'm going to mark this for just, just in case. So yeah, guys, that's my TBR. Ambitious it is. Let me know what is on your guys's TBR for this month, and what you think I should prioritize. Cause like I said, this month I've just been all over the place. Yeah. I will see you guys next time. Bye.